news. Yes, FM. Stupid news. Well, he didn't mean to, but the way it was written in the in the contract, he he meant to buy a building but in turn also bought the city's water tower as well. Yeah, so a small town in Florida accidentally sold its water tower in a completely blundered real estate transaction. Mm-hmm. A businessman purchased a municipal building underneath the city of Brookville's water tower yeah. last April for a mere $55,000. Right. The goal was to convert the building into a gym mm-hmm. so people could come work out and whatnot. Mm-hmm. However, uh, when he went to the county to get an address for his new business location, he was told the parcel he bought also included the entire water tower site. (laughs) County records show he transferred the tower back to Brookville last month. The city manager blamed the use of bad legal description Ah. for what happened because it can't be his fault. it's got to be somebody else. Fortunately, the the guy that bought it was a nice guy and transferred it back, but he could have caused all sorts of issues there. Imagine you go to a thrift store and you buy a painting for $4. Not just any painting, a but David then, Bowie painting. But it turns out it's actually worth twelve grand. Thousand. Yeah, twelve grand. You spent four dollars and nine cents with yeah. HST because this happened in Canada, mm-hmm. and then you started doing a little digging on this painting, and that's going to be auctioned off. It is a late David Bowie painting. Yeah. He actually painted it himself uh-huh. back in 1977, uh, and now they are going to auction it. And they're thinking it's going to go for around 12 grand. Yeah. It could go for more because yeah. he's passed on now. Because so. how many thrift stores are art, are art uh, connoisseurs anyway? Do they really know? Would you what? know? No, I wouldn't know. I, I, didn't I am, know I David am not Bowie artsy like it. that. I wouldn't know but David yeah. did it himself. I yeah, know. so uh, it was a great four dollar investment.